guys, welcome to my channel, The Voice of Diabetes. So if you are a diabetic and you've been on a glucose monitor or you are tired of finger sticks because of course you wanna leave these poor fingers alone from having to prick your fingers all the time, well make sure you guys are tuning into this video because I have some very exciting news to share regarding the new FDA approved implantable continuous glucose monitor that was just approved one week ago and that is a little implantable in your upper arm that will be implanted by your endocrinologist usually um, and that is going to be in you for six months so it's not 10 days not 14 days for an entire six months you don't have to worry about it because you're going to have a glucose monitor inserted that will be sensing your blood sugar levels and telling you what your blood sugar readings are every five minutes so guys welcome back to my channel if you are new this is diana bitucci and welcome to the voice of diabetes uh, please um, consider subscribing to my channel if you want to know all about diabetes and the latest and the greatest Everything in between is what I discuss here. So I am gonna talk about Eversense Continuous Glucose Monitor that was just approved. And I'm very excited because I was at a conference in Barcelona roughly three years ago, and they were talking about this implantable device, and I said, no way, this can't possibly happen anytime soon. I can't believe that we are here in 2022 talking about the same device that I was just at a conference for. It feels like literally yesterday. So I'm very excited, guys, because the more resources we have in the diabetes world. We know that diabetes affects people very differently. Two people can have diabetes and have completely different uh, results and can have completely two different needs. So we know the treatment of diabetes varies and this is why I'm so excited that we have more devices. You're probably wondering, well, what's the big deal? We already have the Dexcom, we already have the Freestyle Libre, why is this exciting? Well, it's exciting because one, it's an implantable device and that's gonna be implanted by your doctor, usually in an office, a procedure that takes about 10 minutes is what they're saying. We are probably gonna be trained on this very soon, but again, remember, this was just FDA approved, not even a, a full week ago. Um, so of course, we need to really see how it's gonna work in real practice, but the clinical data sounds, sound very, very good, and it seems like the accuracy of this is excellent it has been designed it uses a tiny sensor that's inserted under the skin on the arm and it has an attached monitor so normally that will be the transmitter that will transmit information from the sensor that's implanted internally just under the skin and it will give it will shoot out the information of your glucose levels to your phone um, which is pretty awesome a fluorescent chemical that produces a small amount of light when exposed to blood sugar. The light is measured and the measurements are sent via Bluetooth every five minutes to a mobile app that displays readings, trends, and of course alerts depending on where your blood sugar level is heading. So this tiny wireless sensor is obviously inserted under the skin on the upper arm and it's very lightweight, about one to 1.5 inch transmitter. The transmitter can be removed and recharged without discarding the sensor. So then as I mentioned, you have the transmitter that's on top of this inserted uh, sensor and you can remove that literally away from you recharge it without ever having to touch the the sensor that's been implanted inside in the upper arm so that's pretty cool guys because like i said most diabetics are seeing their doctors um, their endocrinologist uh, specialist at least every three months either way the patient is coming to the office so it adding a 10, a 10 minute procedure to remove and replace the sensor every six months. It's not really a big deal uh, because you're being seen anyways and if it's gonna make your life easier where you're not having to change, um, you know, you're not having to constantly change your sensors, that is pretty impressive. I'm also very excited because maybe the accuracy of the sensor is more accurate than others. We know that continuous glucose monitors have, have been phenomenal and they've changed the way that we practice medicine and they have really improved the quality of life of our patients but having something that can be more accurate and hopefully this will link in and become a closed loop system with other pumps that we have on the market this is phenomenal guys and it just goes it goes to show how much research is being done in the diabetes world and how much is improving every day 
Of course, ideally, I hope that one day we will be able to eliminate diabetes through maybe more stem cell research and other things are being studied right now. Uh, but for now, having different and better technologies to help us manage this disease is absolutely important. And in my opinion, every diabetic type 1 or type 2 should be on a continuous glucose monitor because why are we still doing finger sticks? Ouch! In today's, in 2022. So I think this is very remarkable the pricing of this product is not really known yet i will develop more videos on this product once i am aware and hopefully become trained in how to implant this in my own patients you know in the meantime it's just great that this is actually out there and has gotten the fda approval so i'm i am so curious to see as to what will happen in the future and if we'll have an even longer sensor that will be implanted for a year or two years and th guys this is just such a game changer i am so excited if you can't tell by the video and i'm really excited for all the things that are coming that are making life better that are improving diabetes management and that are you know trying to really slow the progression of diabetes and improve the, the patient's quality of life by making managing this disease easier. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you're just as excited as I am. And as I said, the more I learn and once I become trained in this uh, implantable device, I will definitely keep you guys updated. And as always, I will share my opinion and my own research as I have more data and more developments. So I, guys, uh, again, thank you for tuning in. If you are new, I encourage you to subscribe to my channel and share this video and please always feel free to comment below and share your own feelings. I will see you guys all next time. Take care.